Indonesia is seeking Japanese expertise in carrying out a feasibility study on when to begin laying tracks for the proposed Jakarta-Surabaya high-speed train project. The train project, which aims to begin in 2017, could cut current travel time by half to around five hours. Coordinating Maritime Minister Luhut Panjaitan says the government has discussed Jakarta-Surabaya high-speed train project with Japanese government in hopes of accelerating the feasibility study. Japan will soon send representatives and railway experts to conduct a preliminary survey. The results will heavily determine when the project will finally kick off. The project is valued at around $3 billion. Kilometer itu Jakarta uh, Surabaya yang sudah juga sebenarnya disepakati waktu itu nanti dengan Ibu Rini akan kita bicarakan itu juga mereka mau melakukan join survey antara pemerintah Indonesia dan pemerintah uh, Jepang kemudian juga dibicarakan kerjasama kerjasama lain yang inginkan supaya itu bisa terlaksana dalam waktu cepat. Kita berharap kalau ini semua working groupnya ini bekerja, kita berharap itu akan bisa mulai berbagai proyek itu awal atau first quarter next year. Transportation Minister Budi Karya Sumadi says the project will not use state funds with the minister aiming to secure private sector funding. The minister adds the project is a vital infrastructure boost which would provide an alternative mode of travel to flying between major cities. Budi explained travel time between Jakarta and Surabaya would only take around five hours, with the train able to hit top speeds of 200 kilometers per hour, more than halving travel time.